financial you discipline. Were financial <laughs> yeah. 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 Yes. Thank you very much because that uh, your support came at a very critical time for us, and then uh, I thought as a partnership we have managed to salvage. <laughs> So the equation to be achieved. Yes, yes, yes. In that sense, I think we are very determined to implement the capture that will be able to achieve on our progress. Exactly, as you told well earlier, some ownership of Sri Lanka is it's you for all of them. solution to the parliament that we should support the program. So it was voted with 121 voting for and only 20 politically voted against. Main opposition also on some principle, you know, was saying, George, I am FN, we should have a pro time earlier. So in that sense, I think bipartisan or multipartisan kind of an agreement that, that we must go to an That's a good thing. Yeah. They were more or less shy, yes. So, is that the background why SJB abstained? Yeah, uh, uh, SJB abstained because in all of it, the fact that I uh, have come back here, the issue is even So, in that sense, I think that uh, it's my high party uh, agreement. Uh, so, so, it's so about this, um, that's right. Yes. <laughs> now, when we were in cabinet also, uh, before the current cabinet, only one cabinet minister, even two years ago, was opposed. That is Mr. Uh, Honorable Vasudeva. I mean, that, that everybody wanted to go to a charge. I think now people have understood that, with the expertise and the kind of credibility that is. Yeah, so everything uh, now has to go to the secretary to the same constituent. So that way, so they all be there. One day they need to participate in all aspects of uh, whatever else. Yes. At least before the parliament is speaking. It will be taken up on second day, they use the next uh, sitting. Next, yes. next week. Next sitting. Next sitting. Next sitting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So perhaps it may be somewhere on 20th of this month. Date is not fixed as it is. Six committees and you are in the process to establish answers of questions. Our fiscal affairs department should have so the draft document was with us, I suppose. Anti-corruption? Anti-corruption. Yeah. So, so, so the Supreme Court has to... The Supreme Court has to... Uh, it is challenged. Yes. We will be announcing the determination next year. Next year. Ah. Next year. So all uh, the new central bank law we just challenge in the Supreme Court that they have given the opinion subject to certain things we can pass that. Then uh, the budget office is, the, the law is, uh, I mean, draft is to be. Mm -hmm. The anti corruption law uh, is now in the Supreme Court once they will give that subject to that, we can clear that law. So all those laws which are required in terms of our agreements are coming in. Mm -hmm. So hopefully, it should be this opinion. Yeah. Whether a simple majority is required or it needs to be passed by two thirds certain clauses or two thirds plus referendum. Mm -hmm. So that's the whole idea. That's all the Supreme Court can do because Parliament. Mm -hmm. Thank you.
from our Pali Pali Services Assistant. Mm -hmm. okay. so, okay. You can sit from here. Yes. Yes. Ah, so we have the fingerprint first. So when the you can sit and feel. Yeah. <laughs> then the this light will lead. Uh, the green color light will appear. Then you can vote either yes, no or abstain. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. You can vote yes. <laughs> <laughs> This side, yes, <laughs> but sometimes no. Fingerprint. Oh, yeah, yeah. Without the fingerprint, without the fingerprint you can't. You can't. Yeah. You can't. Okay, let's see. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, they, 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 Continuously for 26 days. Okay, yeah. so but uh, next is how it's going to be. Deputy Cabinet Managing Director of IMF, Mr. Kenji Kumura, and ladies and gentlemen, now I'm Honorable Ministers, Members of Parliament. Many at large, several months ago, Today, the majority seems to agree with the IMF and its guidelines. <coughs> Having decided to seek 
IMF assistant in February, March 2022. And non-Paris club member states, member states, we value their patience, coordination, and utmost cooperation enabling Sri Lanka to arrive at it at this point. Both Sri Lanka and the IMF initially, the most, most of the reforms and policy decisions would have been taken a few years back. However, we seem to have missed those. We do not envision the reform for obvious reasons. The measures specially included in the suspension, suspension of government recruitment, the cost of cost effective pricing which was which has increased the fuel, electricity, water and coal prices. Taxes have gone also have gone up from 18 to 34 percent. All development projects were suspended within a few we are aware that some of these painful decisions are not, not people friendly, especially for, for vulnerable communities of the society. However, it will also be handled in the, with internationally. Well, let's just start uh, with this uh, great experience to visit the new island. So, it's very impressive. Uh, I'm pretty much impressed with the architect, architecture and design of uh, famous uh, Sri Lanka, uh, Jeffrey Bawa. And uh, in addition to that, I'm particularly uh, glad uh, was very explicit that Sri Lanka has been hit hard by a catastrophic economy and she has been improved. So it's a positive cycle. So that's why it's essential to keep this momentum, good momentum, sustainability, as quickly as possible. With um, <coughs> the purpose to demonstrate uh, physically present and background. Uh, I'm just up here. Thank you very much.